<laughs> What's up, dude? What are you doing? Is there a way we could both talk on this stream? I don't know how to do that with two people. Because that would make way more sense than, like, you having to type. And then we could kind of hang out. <clears throat> What? How? How do we do it? Tell me! <clears throat> oh. Oh. I'd have to... Where's your art chat? I'm on your art chat. <clears throat> you should, uh, call me and walk me through it. Okay. Are you there? Did I join? Hi. Oh, there you are. As a audio source? Yeah, like capturing your desktop audio. Uh, let's see. Um, desktop audio. Huh. I don't see it as a... Leave it. I can hear my voice come through. Okay. It's not like echoing around and getting crazy. No, because you're not capturing it. I mean, I can turn it all the way down and talk to you. It doesn't matter. No, it doesn't matter to me. I don't mind if, you know, unless we're going to talk about private stuff. So this one time, when I was young, <laughs> I was hanging out with my uncle. And... <laughs> so you could stream some stuff, too, and, and we could chat. I could. I could. I, I have... I was actually streaming earlier. I know, I saw you were doing some Minecraft. Yeah, just, it was kind of random. I yeah. didn't have anything, like, I, I'm just, you know, setting up my stream because I just want to get something uh, in order. Um, yeah. So that I can do, like, morning time kind of warm-ups and stuff. Yeah, and, I hear you. I mean, I had, I had already started doing that a while ago, and now it's just, like, I figure I might as well put it to use. And, that's kind of how I felt. I was like, you know what? I have the extra time with no commute. Uh, I should really get back to the stuff I was feeling like I didn't have time for. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. You know, yeah. no reason not to. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, I was I was at Kelly's when I when I got the uh, alert for your uh, Minecraft oh, stream. That's why you didn't tune in. You yeah. <laughs> I, I tuned in briefly, but, uh, you know, it was just yeah. when Kelly was, no. was in the kitchen. But <laughs> uh, My stream looked like shit. I was still just kind of technical, you know, uh, crunching on, on, like, how what to set my bit rate at and all that stuff. Yeah, I ended up just kicking mine down today to, to 4,500 to see if... Because if, I know a few people, like, didn't have as fast a connections and... Um, though I haven't really heard anyone complaining about the, uh, um, 
it actually looks pretty good right now. Cool. Um, yeah, the only thing I notice is is like when I do some rescaling, it it gets a little uh, a little choppy, um, <clears throat> which you'll see in just a yeah. See, so like. Yeah, it's it's not as smooth, but it's I mean whatever it's not bad. People don't need to see me like smoothly zoom in and out. I guess. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't think that's a necessity when it comes to <laughs> yeah. stuff. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> it's funny. I'd spent all this time on her hair earlier, but I had made the the light coming through her hair all warm, and I was like, wait a second, yeah. she's got full on blue hair. It should be yeah. like hot blue. <laughs> so yeah, I had to I had to redo it. It was bugging me. I, I don't think I saw it prior to that. Yeah. Um, well, I repainted over that layer, so you ain't gonna see it. <laughs> That's good, man. I'm liking where, that, where that thing is going. Thanks. Um, yeah, it's dude. It's a lot of fun. And fun, kind of tackling them one at a time, and you know. <clears throat> good good times of course now I'm like running out of layers so I think I've got to start to consolidate some layers in fact I should probably do that now if I'm going to get into the next character or anything what's your, what's your maximum layers on that, on that file? on this one in particular Let's wait for it to try and duplicate. Um, <clears throat> let's see here. It's like too much all at once. Chill. Uh, maximum layers is 26 layers. On this one. Because I'm working at A3 size. Right. Which is like the size of the really big moleskin. Right. You know, so uh, I'm working at that size at 300 dp. No, did I? I may have kicked it down to 200 dpi because I know that it's going to be printing at A4, so it's going to be printing smaller. So I didn't mind kicking it down to 200 dpi. Uh, hang on, just putting, putting my headphones away. So let's see, I gotta see if I can consolidate these. Um, well, I can ditch that. I've seen in, um, Harris Heller's stream elements today on my stream. Uh, Harris Heller's stream elements? I don't know that. I don't know what that is. Uh, well, Harris Heller said he's like, he's just a streamer, but he set up a bunch of free to use music for your stream. Mm. So. That's cool. You can, uh, you can just, uh, throw that up on Spotify or any other, I mean, yeah, he basically has it on every service. Oh. Spotify, Amazon Music, a bunch of other ones. Huh. Did that work okay? Oh. It's yeah, not that bad. I mean, it's cool. like, you know, there's a, a good good amount of, like, electronica. Yeah. Um, but it's, uh, it's not bad. That's cool. Yeah, I've just been sticking mostly to just soundtracks that I know don't, don't get totally flagged. <laughs> yeah. Is that, uh, has that been working for you? Yeah, for the most part, except, uh... One of them I noticed did, and I think it was something from the um, uh, Red Dead thing. I think I may have had some of the uh, vocal tracks selected, and those will tend to get flagged. I feel like the other music doesn't, but I could be wrong, and it was just like... A couple little sections but what sucked is that normally if I'm talking over it in the past it wouldn't mute 
because it, it was catching my voice more. But this time it muted that whole section and I was talking wow. at that time. So I was like, well, that's that's lame. Um, so I was like, all right, well, I'm going to stick to the ones that I know are safe. <laughs> Um, All right, th there we go. Now we got a double stream going. Oh, cool. Are you you're streaming too? Yeah. Sweet. What are you streaming? A little Photoshop. Cool. Cool. Is there a way? Can I like watch your stream? Make it all tiny so that I can. Make sure and uh, continue uh, continue monitoring the quality on it. Yeah. There you are. There you are. Lo and behold, it actually works. There you are. Where? Little double art stream for the fans of art. Fuck yeah. <clears throat> um. Get in here and do some hard edges on this thing because it's feeling a little soft and squishy. Yeah. Oh, that's looking good though, dude. I hadn't seen it yeah, since it's... like your thumbnail. I I got some color action going on it, but I just like I'm not really happy with uh, that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like that's a big fat no. <laughs> <laughs> But it's just uh, so I figured I'd, I'd kind of knock back and, and get it, get some like sharper edges and more kind of drawing stuff going in there. And yeah. Really get some control going and then kind of move forward. Weird. Yeah, do it in the fucking public eye because you know. Right. Show everyone that you're doing it for real. It's weird because you would think on one hand, you know, you would have like a ton of time on your hands, but at the same time, it's like, it's hard to plan right now because like with so many things up in the air, I think it's tricky for people to really create like their own schedule and stick to it. Yeah. At least, you know, for the less disciplined. <laughs> <laughs> She, she, you know, she, she does her, her gig, her job, yeah. and she has some other things that she's, 
she's working on, and she had a she had a podcast in the works, and that uh, basically it kind of overlapped with when I I was doing we were doing the recording for the for the art thing. Okay. So it just you know it just ultimately did not work out. Yeah. Uh, which is too too bad because her personality is perfect for it, you know. Yeah. Uh, kind of over the top and, and sassy and everything. Yeah. Which is, which is, it's fun when you get down to that. Right? Yeah. So, um, that being said, start, start again and just keep on pushing for it because I think there's some potential there and I, hmm. uh, I'm getting the editing chops together. Right on. Yeah, Kelly is looking at. She's been jumping back into like After Effects. So that's cool. Is she uh, is she animating some of her art? I don't I don't know exactly. I don't think she's necessarily wanting to animate her art. I um, I think she used to do like. Uh, more uh, title animations and stuff um, and and she I guess she used to really like doing that and but it's been a, a while now so she just wanted to kind of get back into it so she's been digging back in yeah, it seems like there's a lot of kind of uh, retracement yeah people, yeah right where, where everybody's like oh there was this this stuff that I used to do more. Yeah. And, and now I can, not necessarily like now I have more time to do it, but now that there's not all of the exterior noise, yeah. I can I can do it. Yeah. yeah. Next step is to get an NDI feed from your camera to my my setup on this side <laughs> and uh and then we can have we can have like the dual the dual screen <laughs> what like a split screen thing yeah 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 that's hectic <laughs> <laughs> yeah for sure <laughs> people would be into that hopefully it would be uh would be the type of thing where where i mean the guys from the drink and draw are doing it right oh are they where they'll, get, they'll get together and they'll do like a split screen that's cool yeah there's there's this thing stream i don't want to see stream duck or duck something or other i don't know there's a duck in the logo that's <laughs> what I and i and like i went to the website and it just did like i did not trust it because it felt like something from like the early 2000s God. like web 1.5 you know? we were <laughs> like, like must oh, have man. Netscape to run this <laughs> <laughs> yeah it definitely uh, it was a little sketchy it was a little sketchy <laughs> Yeah. Um, but it's there's just the little subtle, subtle kind of pushes and pulls that are happening. Yeah. It's um, where you're like, oh, I can I can move that over there, I can move that over there, and, and, and just that little movement you can like it, you can see where that initial the initial line would be was or, or shape idea was there, but then it wasn't the the ideal idea. Right. Right. The, the ideal ideal representation. Yeah. You know. so, kind of cool to uh, be able to slow it 
Um, yeah, I've been enjoying it a lot. Like being able to just not have to completely just power through everything. Um, yeah. yeah. You know, we've we've done a bit of that in our day. <laughs> yeah, you know, deadlines. <laughs> I love them for lighting a fire, but man, yeah, stacked up against each other. Ooh, boy. Yeah. I feel like. Um, and I mean, you know, it's like even the um, like even without like the stacked up deadlines these days just you know back when we were just having to crank out uh, sketches you know yeah um, seven or eight in a day <laughs> Stream awards in your channel, there, buddy. Um, I don't know. <laughs> I I like just recently found out that that's a thing. <laughs> like, you mean those points? Yeah. Those like in the chat or whatever. Yeah. Yeah, I just recently found out that that's a thing, so I I don't actually know what kind of stuff. <laughs> I can uh that's stuff, that's stuff that you have to set up. I know, that's the thing. Like I don't know what kind of stuff people do with it. Oh okay. You know, so um I saw uh, uh Ergo Josh will do like an art roast if you submit like ten thousand points or something, then then you can give him a link to a piece of yours or, or something and, and he'll basically critique it you know, on the stream. Okay. Um, and, and it was fun. Like, people were really into it. I thought that was cool. Yeah. yeah. Like, I liked that, that uh, people were, were doing it. Yeah, I mean, obviously, that's, that's, that's one way. I've seen yeah. some streamers use it, use it for stream health. And that's, uh, like, some of them are using it to, to get uh, their... their followers and watchers up and about so like uh one of the streamers has her so you can redeem a uh drink water uh, oh yeah yeah i saw i like, saw something like it'll, that it'll like ping off on the on the in the channel yeah hey, drink water yeah and that was actually like well when we were at work and i was watching i was able to watch before we got the, the firewall fucking right firewall oh, the high place. security <laughs> yeah uh that was one of the one of the one of the streamers I was watching. She constantly had people like pinging that, and hmm. it, like actually made me drink water. Yeah, yeah. I was like, oh yeah, I should probably make sure and hydrate. Yeah. And then there was another one for like stretching and stuff like that. So yeah. I thought that was kind of cool. Yeah. You know. Yeah, I think uh, there's the that one one girl who I'm totally blanking on her name, the, uh, the Dutch girl uh Cy 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 Ciaran I don't know how you pronounce it but anyway she I think she does something where she'll speak Dutch for a minute um 
<laughs> like she has to speak Dutch for a minute when people redeem points or something like that. I thought that was funny. That was funny. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know what I would do with, with that. I, like, I, I saw that I could set it up and, you know, I, like, nobody's watching my fucking streams anyway, so it <laughs> So, um, but, you know, I, at some point I'll figure out something cool. Yeah, hopefully. yeah. Um, I do like the, 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 the critique Type of thing. Yeah, I thought that was fun. I, w- I was just thinking, like, I could do almost like a demo thing if someone wanted, like, had a specific question. Yeah. You know? Know. Even though I do the demos anyway, and I really enjoy doing them, so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's just a nice way yeah. for me to kind of keep that information in my head and, and help myself to sure. understand it a little more, so. Sure. Yeah. Um,. You know, like a, it could be like an AMA type of thing, you know, 10,000, 10,000 stream points, it's a, it gets you an AMA and that's, you know, I think it gives everybody an opportunity to ask a question or something. What, what's an AMA? What's an AMA? Ask me anything. Oh, ask me anything. Come on, man, get with your Reddit lingo. <laughs> Fucking old man. I am old. <laughs> you are not old. Jesus. You haven't, you haven't fallen and broken your hip yet. So <laughs> Hell, I haven't even fallen yet. Yeah, Kelly and I are talking about how this year just doesn't count. Just doesn't what? It does. This year doesn't count. Oh yeah, yeah. So, um, so I'm still 39. Absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> we we didn't have the party for it. You didn't need. I know, right? Yeah. It's a weird lost year, man. You know? Yeah, I'm not a fan. Not a fan. Just like, I literally have not left this fucking cave. <laughs> <laughs> I, I would say the thing that this year has taught me is that I feel really bad for animals in the zoo. Yeah. <laughs> like, it's really given me a respect for the little tiny enclosures. I'm like, damn. Poor tigers. <laughs> okay, you gotta make sure. Only perspective. Right. They don't even have the fucking internet. Right. Oh, I hope you have your adult filter on because, like, I'm swearing up a storm in your channel. Uh, I, I tend to swear a bit. I don't really have it. I don't have an age gate on it. Oh, okay. Yeah, because I noticed, I noticed, like, Evan, Evan will swear on his, Uh, and he doesn't have an age gate, and he has way more viewers than I do. (laughs) Yeah. Alright. I mean, maybe there's, like, a limit. Or something of like how many you can do in a minute, or I don't know. <laughs> I think, uh, I think uh, YouTube has introduced a, uh, a like a way to, to check monetization, and so you can have things like profanity as one, and and adult subject matter as another, and so huh. there's like now there's like levels of 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 what things are and how hmm. questionable they are. Yeah. Interesting. Uh, yeah. I just know that uh, uh, getting what I'm doing uh, with the kind of video game arc stuff monetized is going to mm-hmm. be a son of a bitch. Hmm. Because we are definitely, it's definitely adult content. Exactly. Yeah. Bordering on on South Park style stuff. 
<laughs> and we all know YouTube isn't really big on that kind of humor. Right. And advertisers most certainly aren't, so my thought was that I'll probably like bleep everything out mm -hmm. and um, and then we'll set up a Patreon page and the patrons will get access to the unedited versions. Of uh, I gotcha. Right? Yeah. Bleeping can be kind of fun too though. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know? definitely. There's some humor in there that I'm that I'm looking forward to doing at some point. <laughs> Like, my one idea was to actually have something for the patrons even where it's like the entire episode is just like beeps, and then <laughs> at the very end, it's somebody goes, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> or like, every, every, every word that isn't a swear word is beeped. Yeah. <laughs> you know, just some, some kind of goofy shit. Did you ever see that kind of dumb movie, uh, Cuffs, with, uh, Christian Slater? Back, I think it was in the 90s. I, I, don't, I don't watch dumb movies. <laughs> and then two, I definitely don't watch Christian Slater in anything other than <laughs> Mr. Robot. I just remember there was one scene, because it was PG-13, right? So mm -hmm. uh, they couldn't, and it was in the 90s, so they couldn't really drop, like, F-bombs and stuff. But there's a whole, like, scene where he's he's just swearing up one of the, I don't remember if it was him or if it's, this guy, uh, the, the other guy in there, and he's, like, swearing up a storm. It's just, like, beep, 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 you know, just for the longest time. And then at the end, I think, of, of his rant, Christian Slater says something smart-ass, and then the guy just goes, fuck you. It, but he actually, like, drops the F-bomb. And so it's just, it was, it was pretty funny. Like, I hadn't, I hadn't seen that in a movie before, and I don't think I've really seen it since. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but I just remember. Yeah. Well, I thought it was pretty like clever. I did my idea, so. Oh well. Yeah, but no one remembers it. Right. Except me. I don't. I guess no one else saw cuffs. <laughs> no one alive anymore. <laughs> Although who knows, man? The '90s are back, and so maybe, uh, maybe all the kids are watching all the '90s movies. And he's back already? Yeah, yeah, we're kind of like getting past him actually and, and maybe getting into the uh, early aughts. <laughs> oh, cool. I can, I can frost my tips again. <laughs> <laughs> so, so stupid. <laughs> Don't do that. No, there will be no frosting of tips. <laughs> it's not going to happen. I'm glad to say I never did that. I don't actually think I did either. I think that was that was a little more uh, shock, I want to say, than I was. Yeah. Shock rock, I guess. Right. Where are we? I always get to that part where I'm like, do I drop down the line work and then just start painting on top of it? <laughs> I tend to keep... I don't know. I tend to, uh, like, at least keep it as a layer. And then I'll just uh, kick the opacity down on it. Yeah. You know? And then I'll paint on a layer above it. Clipping masks, man. Clipping masks. <laughs> For sure, man. <laughs> yeah, whatever. It's art, man. It's not an exact science. Yeah. 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 We're just here to have fun. <laughs> just here. To render the shit out of this. <laughs> Maybe I can get one of each style of my kind of art up into my 
I'm into my Twitch stream. Mm. So, yeah, get some paint really stuff, get some some pixels, that sort of thing. Nice. Nice. Just so, so people know what they're getting, right? Yeah. Yeah, at some point I'll get back to being able to um, do some traditional stuff. Yeah. It's I funny, I just haven't been in the mood to do pencils lately, though. Yeah. Yeah. I've been enjoying either digital or inks, one of the two, so... So much of the job is around certain materials. Yeah. It's hard. It's hard to gear into it, you know. Yeah. Um, in your in your off hours, so. <clears throat> that for sure. So I'm doing a bunch of uh, research in my off time research and development for media concerns. Nice. Set up a merch shop on Teespring. Oh yeah? Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Figure it's the easy way to do it and they actually have some really nice, uh, uh, what do you call it, uh, t-shirt material stuff. Like they're all, you know, those real soft shirts and shit. Yeah. So. Right on. Yeah. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with having a easy access for fans. Yeah. All three of them. <laughs> Also, for anyone watching, don't be afraid to join in the chat. And uh, if you have yeah, any, speak on up. yeah, if you have any questions about anything, or you know, I mean anything, art, life, art, life. <laughs> That's everything, apparently, to me, is art and life. Like, that's it. I was going to say, it doesn't sound like there's a whole lot of variance in your, uh, in your uh, approach there, buddy. Yeah. I've, I've been pretty uh, single-minded in a lot of ways lately. Lately? What are you talking about? I tend to be pretty single-minded. Indeed you do, sir. <laughs> it's not a bad thing to uh to have a passion you know yeah borderline obsession not even borderline i am obsessed with art i'm okay with that yeah man it's, there's okay there, there are much like more unhealthy things to be obsessed with yeah so <clears throat> and for anyone wondering, I'm uh, talking with my buddy Autumn, Autumn Rain Turkel. Um, he he's on Twitch as well. He's streaming on his channel, which is Ar Turkel. There we go. Cool. That's way easier than me trying to. Uh... <laughs> Yeah, you know, it's, it's interesting to, to have that obsession with art. Um, and for me, I am i don't know if I would say lucky that it waxes and wanes, but I feel like I have to step away from it and do other creative pursuits so that yeah. when I come back to it, my passion levels are higher. Sure. Um, I feel like when I'm not working... Day, day in and day out in a, in a creative field um, 
uh, it, it certainly recharges a lot faster. Yeah. You know? But also, like, when yeah. you step away, you're still tepping this, you're still tending to step into another creative field like maybe you're not drawing and painting but maybe you're making music or something like that so yeah you know yeah. there's still like yeah. you're not yeah. really yeah. like you're still being yeah. creative yeah it's not necessarily it's not necessarily high brow, you know yeah, yeah. one would say it's it's not capital art right Oh, for sure. And then storytelling. You tie, you tie, storytelling. You tie in the uh, you tie in the modern day skills of social media and uh, <clears throat> video editing and, and and finishing something up and it's a uh, there's a lot in there that you're learning and growing with. Yeah. just been too exposed to YouTube recently hmm. because it's you know it's kind of it's it's a bite size kind of uh, informational type of thing right it's not not as bite size as say TikTok or, or one of those man I just can't uh, I can't do TikTok I just I don't yeah. get it <laughs> <laughs> you know what it was though when I opened up TikTok because people were like, "Oh my god, you should totally do TikTok because you do these videos and people there are like videos and blah blah blah." And I was like, "All right, what the hell is this TikTok thing?" And um, you know, I know him as a character from Return to Oz. Um, <laughs> um, <laughs> so I opened it up, dude. I couldn't. I looked at it. I was like, "Nope." Like, it was such an ugly interface that I was like, this looks like it's intentionally supposed to look bad, and I can't do that. I, yeah. Like, yeah. I don't mind a simple interface. Like, totally fine with right. that, but it looks like they were going for that, like, bad 90s website design. Well, you know, I say the 90s are back. I know, and like people think it's a good thing, and it's like, dude, I'm sorry, plaid and khakis was not a good thing, ever. <laughs> like, it's just, come on. You know, it was like, the 90s were such a blatant, like, uh, revolt against the just like craziness of the 80s that they just went bland. Everything, yeah. except the music, the music in the 90s was awesome. But yeah. everything else was just intentionally like bland, and I couldn't yeah. couldn't do it. Wasn't, was not good. It was yeah. not good at all. I mean, granted, in the nineties, yes, I wore some khakis and I wore some plaid. You did? I did. Oh my god! Oh. But I, whatever, whatever works for you, man. Yeah. And I did shop at Miller's Outpost and get Beyond Baggy Jeans. <laughs> uh, I was poor. 
summer as fuck. I used to, I used to get my baggy jeans from Ross, dress for less budget. I got a lot from Ross too, honestly. Yeah. Dude, do you know? Did you know that they're open to like? I don't know about right now in lockdown, but they're open till like one a.m. The yeah, one on just, Lake. Don't you remember uh, Comic Con? I don't even remember. Oh, uh, when we had to go get a carpet. Yeah. A rug <laughs> so, for the booth. Yeah. Yeah. It was fucking middle of the night. We're like, oh well, now that we've drank and we've had dinner and all this shit, now we can think about this. What's That's all funny. Wait, we did we actually go there? I thought we went there in in the morning the next day. No, we. Oh, maybe we did. I feel like we did. No, no, no. We were there at night. I remember. Were we? I remember looking out and there was like sketchy people outside. <laughs> like, uh. <laughs> Yeah, the gas lamp uh, changes. <laughs> I saw they're doing like all the virtual shit for Comic Con or like an online thing this year. Yeah, yeah. I, I caught. Uh, what did I catch? Oh, the uh, the black suit Superman from the from the Snyder Cut. Huh. Yeah, that was a terrible movie. <laughs> I you know I. Here's the here's the weird. Wait, are we talking movie. Justice League? Yeah, yeah, Justice League. Yeah, yeah, that movie is fucking awful. I mean, the 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 version that came out was shit, and I'm gonna go ahead and blame your your golden boy for it, <laughs> Joss Whedon. Yeah. <laughs> um, but only because uh, he was brought in on the middle of a project. And well, yeah, I mean, uh, you know, I don't know if. Yeah, and, you know, I don't know if anyone yeah. expected it to be amazing, but yeah. <clears throat> um, so I I want to see what he has in mind for a three hour and fifteen minute Justice League movie. The fuck? Because apparently <laughs> that's that's the runtime on that thing. Holy shit! Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> like, I just I don't I can't see extra scenes making it better because the scenes that were there already are not good <laughs> the only like the best part in that movie is wonder woman by so far yeah 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 and i just can't do ezra whatever as flash ezra, 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 ezra tool bag. <laughs> <laughs> yeah i just ezra, i can't i can't do ezra, i like to beat up women yeah that guy I just, like, I can't work with him as Flash. Grant Gustin is... Grant Gustin is my Flash. I don't know, man. <laughs> I, I was trying to watch the latest season of The Flash. And I, I, I'm not as into it anymore, but I like um, him. It's, they like, they've done so much. I'm just like, it's yeah. just so much of a repeat, you know? Yeah, there is definitely a... Uh, that aspect it's hard like you know what do you do when you get into those seasons that are like 22 episodes you know yeah. you cover yeah. a lot of ground with that 20 something episodes long and you're like trying to fill that with meaningful <clears throat> content yeah yeah that's uh that's why i'm actually kind of a fan of the doom patrol like um like I'm watching that, and it's, uh, it's solid. It's got good storytelling. and I'll have to kind of uh, try and get back to it, because I, I liked it, but I it didn't quite grab me like the boys did. No, I mean, there were no boys that grabbed me. Let's just make that clear. <laughs> I'm, I'm completely safe in lockdown right now. But <laughs> the show, the boys, <laughs> grabbed me. <laughs> Uh, no, I, I, I feel like if you give it a chance, like that. Did you watch the first episode and then not go past it? Uh, I think I watched the first two episodes. Hmm. I'll get back to it though, honestly, because like, I was, uh, I was sort of then starting to get back into streaming, and then it was like, well, do I want to spend my time watching something, or would I rather do some art and hop online and, you know. So it it was more of a timing thing, I think. Um, 
I, I just been watching like an episode at lunch. Like, yeah. When I sit down for lunch, you know, because they're yeah. like, like 40, 40 some minutes. Yeah. So, but yeah, I think it's a, uh, it's like you look at the, the character arcs and the, the way that they're kind of delivering information and all that stuff, and I think it's, it's actually pretty good. And uh, what's his name? Who's the dude from uh, uh, from Firefly? Oh, Alan Tudyk. Yeah. Yeah. I never say his last name. Uh, he's he's great, dude. Yeah. He's uh he's he's uh he's got a great kind of over the top kind of way to, of acting, but yeah. Also, he's really good at like bringing it in. Yeah, absolutely. And then on top of that, he's got a great voice for voice acting. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, like he's got that narrator voice thing going, and I'm like, yeah, <laughs> solid. <laughs> so, it's very enjoyable. And uh, I actually think, uh, what's his name? From the mummy? Brendan Fraser. Yeah, he's good. Yeah. He's, I mean, George, he's George, aged, George of the Jungle. He's good, man. Yeah. That you're like referencing the 90s. <laughs> After I'm just like talking shit about him. <laughs> uh, I like um, my chat, but my chat is really just you. So, uh, <laughs> and I can say hi to you in person. <laughs> Yeah, um, I like um, Timothy Dalton in there. He's fucking rad. Yeah, absolutely. Like his voice is so awesome. I'm just like, dude, this guy needs to do more like character stuff now because yeah, he just got one of those great um, character voices now. Yeah, I think overall the casting in that is really good. Yeah. <clears throat> and it, it's interesting because I I don't think I ever read the comic of it. I never but did. It, feel, it feels really familiar for some reason. Huh. I don't think I even knew about the comic. is finally going to be a thing. The what? Finally, New Mutants. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There was a, there was a, a Comic-Con online trailer for it, I think. Oh, cool. Yeah. Looks good, dude. New Mutants. <clears throat> Shot with years ago now or something yeah that's crazy i and i was waiting for that thing too i was like dude i was excited for that yeah right because didn't they come out with a trailer for that like ages ago uh-huh and then it got pushed back yeah because, i think it was a filmmaker issue or something like the director or something hmm. i don't i don't know the whole specifics on it but it's pretty convoluted streaming games I just had my my uh, seamless up but figure for art my my background's gonna have to be something a little more intriguing right I just have my fucking bookshelf and shelf of paintings and <laughs> yeah well luckily I have a shallow enough depth of field so I'm not gonna get pinged for the uh, yeah yeah figure <laughs> <laughs> For the <laughs> naughty bits. <laughs> <laughs> like, no, no, that's not a naked individual. <laughs> it's art. For fuck's sake. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> yes, it does. And I, I keep wanting to be like, oh no, don't worry about that part. No, I guess you need to worry about that part. And every, like, painterly is good for specific places. Yeah. You know, it's funny because a lot of times, um, at least with digital stuff, I will. Like, I'll tend to render it and then go in and, and do some painterly mm -hmm. on top of it to loosen stuff back up. Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, then you, I mean, there's still that, that element of being built up. Like, you get those, you get those kind of layers of stuff going. Yeah. But then, then you have more kind of edge control over what is... Uh, a painterly edge. Yeah. I just have a tendency to want to really get into that painterly stuff probably a little too early, I think. Mm. Where, where my brain's just like, let, let, let's just get painterly on it. And then <laughs> without getting that, that full render yet, you know? Right. I mean, you can, obviously, you can just go right into the painterly if you want to. Um, yeah. It's just like, know, like a very different I feel technique. Like it's a lot stronger to have that support under it, though. Yeah. At least from what I've been experiencing, trying to do some more of this kind of illustrated fantasy stuff, mm. it just feels like to, there's a certain amount of it that needs to be uh, judiciously spelled out. Yeah. Yeah, and the nice thing about doing it that way is is you can uh, really pick where you want it to stay rendered and, and where you want it to be painterly. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm not going to go League of Legends on it, you know? <laughs> right. Because those guys render the shit out of their stuff. Yeah. Days you got left on your Kickstarter? Uh, twelve days. I think. Yeah. I'm I'm hoping we can at least unlock the uh, extra pages with the um, Dakota short story in there. I think that'd be rad. I mean, I'd love to unlock the gilded edges. I don't know if we'll get that far, though. But it would be fun just because it would look dope. Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, it already looks pretty fucking amazing, so... Just from, you know, everything that's been posted on it. Yeah. I'm really excited about it. Yeah, Spiridon has done good. He done good.
What is it that's uh, not working for you? It's just uh, some, like, there's a, a couple of little anatomy things that probably should have been worked out well long ago. Mm. Within, the, within the, uh, the actual process. Yeah. Because I feel like uh, his head tilt mixed with his fin, the fin that he has on his head, mm -hmm. mixed with her hand and arm shape is not, uh, not feeling, not feeling right to me. Hmm. Like, something is just not, it's that kind of like, there's tangents and things that are working against what I'm trying to accomplish. Yeah. Those I'm not. Fucking tangents, man. <laughs> It's like the character is designed. He's like he's been designed. I can't just be like, well, oh, I've changed the design of the character a little bit. <laughs> right. Sometimes you can though. It's an artist's interpretation. Yeah, but I was the designer to begin. I know. <laughs> 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 well, it doesn't work for this pose, so I'm just going to make some shit up that works for whatever I want to draw. Uh, oh, man, we watched a tour to pharmacy the other night. How was that? That, it was hilarious. Oh, yeah? Yeah, like, it was way funnier than I thought it was going to be. <clears throat> okay. Um, it was, yeah. That's not Sandberg. Yeah, it's it's Sandberg. Okay. Uh, I'm more a fan of him than I am of uh, the oldest and Alfred. Yeah, no, I I like Andy Sandberg a lot. I always liked him, even on SNL, all his uh, digital shorts. Those things were yeah. just awesome. He's the guy that did Dig in a Box, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And Natalie Portman raps. Oh, yeah. And a uh, red flag. Yeah. <laughs> that still pings off in my head. I know, <laughs> right? Red flag. Red flag. Her ex boyfriend was a club promoter. <laughs> red flag. <laughs> <laughs> Wants to be a comic book artist. <laughs> <laughs> Too real. <laughs> <laughs> She's a married woman. <laughs> <laughs> set up like a specific brush set for this yeah uh, i've been like really used to using certain brushes and i'm trying not to strictly use those brushes <laughs> so i feel like like personally i feel like that's kind of like if you're only getting your style from the brushes you're using it's it's a little bit of a crutch yeah i so, think i think you definitely want to air on the side of using brushes that maybe fit with your technique rather than basing your technique on the brushes yep yeah. <clears throat> like that that stuff that i'm doing for work it's a hundred percent the brushes 
but hey at least that then will lend itself to some like consistency you know oh yeah yeah for sure like getting getting somebody in to help me on the second half of the yeah project is going to be very easy because i'll be like okay for this part this portion here is this brush this person here is this or yeah is this brush only use this brush here, 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 and here. <laughs> After that, put another layer there, and then use this brush, and it, you're done. It's like paint by numbers. Oh, it's 100%. <laughs> like, oh, I, got it. I had it down to a science by the end of the third big one, where I was just like, okay, <laughs> step A, step B, step C, step D, step E, I'm fucking done. Next. Nice. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Finished aspect of it. Yeah. The process was mildly mind numbing. So many characters. And by mind mildly mind numbing, I mean I had to like sit my ass down and do the fucking work. Don't move. Don't even move your eyeballs. Yeah. You're gonna wanna go to YouTube or fucking Facebook or something. Just sit there. Just fucking sit there and do the work. You're just like, fuck this. I'm going to MySpace. Anything. <laughs> My brain is so just like, I've done this hundreds of times before. God damn it. I think that's ultimately why I kind of, I had like a curse snap there where I was just like, all right, I need to do something fucking different because my creative brain is losing it. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. It's funny because I kind of already had set up the colors for this character. Like when I did the the shirt design. Mm -hmm. But then I sort of changed the um thinking behind their coloring as I was doing this and I still like the initial one that I set up but then it doesn't fit with the methodology of, of like the coloring on the others <laughs> did you did you get a high print run on the shirts no 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 I haven't like no I can absolutely change the shirts it's not that it's that I actually like the color scheme that I set up on the shirt um, for her but then it would be completely different methodology than the other two characters which yeah. doesn't yeah. doesn't quite work so so I'm having to like rethink her currently <clears throat> but I think as a trio, they will work better if there is that kind of, a bit of that consistency. Your chat is mighty quiet tonight. I know. On, honestly, like, it usually is, unless I can, like, give people a bit more warning that I'm going to be going on. It was pretty, like, I posted on Instagram, but I, I was, like, starting instantly, so. Yeah. And. I mean, it is also Sunday night. Yeah. And people were, I like, I was on earlier today, and, you know, there were people in the chat at that point. Okay. So. I must have missed that. I didn't see that you were on. I would have, I would have jumped on. Uh, I think you were doing stuff. Okay. The arc stuff. Right. So. <clears throat> but since I figured, I'm like, well, I'm going to work on this piece some more anyway. I might as well stream it. Okay, chat, we're done here. See you next time. 
Love y'all. <laughs> Word. Are you calling it a night? Yeah. I think I'm gonna cool. turn in for the evening. Yeah, I guess about that time. I might, uh. We'll see. I wanna do a little more on this. Yeah, yeah. I just I figured an hour is good on mine, so. Yeah. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Call it a night and get some reading in. So cool. We'll talk to you later, buddy. All right, dude. On stream. Yup. Thanks for hanging out with me, in Daniel's chat. We'll see you next time. <laughs> All right, dude. Have a good night. Peace. <clears throat> All right, chat. It's just us. gesture controls or the like the sensitivity on the iPad is just not picking up my gesture controls for some reason. Which is very annoying. I don't like it. Hello. <clears throat> Digging that. I'm digging her.
don't forget <clears throat> our hair tie. feel like she needs I might need to push the separation a bit more in the colors I think mostly in those lights I think I want the lights to go lighter bit more visual interest when we get that shadow layer over the top. Hey, hey, cut it out. Crazy cat. She's not going to cut it out. There's a cardboard box that has like, a, you know, the holes for the handles. So she sees like inside that hole and she just tries to grab whatever is inside the box, which is nothing of interest. She just feels the need. Let's do...
to my original kind of color scheme for her she had like her whole body was more sort of blues she didn't have any magenta hits on her body it was just on her hair which I still kind of like but I've already like kind of set up some other stuff on the other two so oh well I like this too Let's try this. That's better. Whee! Right. Shit. Damn it. Why don't we go on the right layer? Does that sound like a fun game?
can see there are a few of us hanging out still. I hope everyone's having a good Sunday. I had a good Sunday. I know that. Got some art done. Had some delicious dinner. Delicious cocktails. I'm actually going to wrap it up here pretty soon. Um, I just wanted to kind of get this portion of it done. <clears throat> and then I can jump into doing the rim lights and stuff tomorrow. Rim lights and then hit those, you know, the different planes with the actual painting. And, uh, oh, this thing's killing me. Um, wrap her up tomorrow, probably tomorrow night. that with an ad layer. Word. Alright, well, I'm liking where the colors are going. Yeah, she actually looks pretty rad. She looks pretty rad with those colors. I can dig it. Oh, let's turn that off so it doesn't make her look weird. Uh, we can actually, whoops, no, no. Delete, delete, delete that layer, delete that layer. Um, yeah, these girls are gonna be dope. <clears throat> I feel like she might need a little more contrast or something in her face. But, I don't know. We'll see. I'll wait till after we can fine-tune fine -tune them together. Alright, guys. Um, until tomorrow, uh, I'm going to call it. I'm going to call it a night. 11 p.m. here, so I think it's a good time for me to go to bed. Um, thank you all for joining me. Um, glad we got her colors laid in in the basic shadows so that's, that's a good thing um, cool I'll see y'all tomorrow peace